Hello everyone, welcome to another 11 Labs tutorial video. In this tutorial video, I will show you how to use and change language in 11 Labs and use different language in 11 Labs. So, first of all, make sure text to speech is turned on. Now, as you can see, if we go here to settings, we can see that there are a lot of American voices and British and English Italian voices and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, what I want to do is I want to actually um, I translated here. Hello there. My name is Juan and I wanted to basically copy this from Spanish and I want to put it right here. Now what I let's say I want to do Spanish, right? That's one thing. What I can do is I can go here and uh, again, I can go and I can find, uh, for example, Giovanni is um, English Italian. That can be similar to Spanish, right? So we can click on that. We can also go here and click on 11 multilingual V1. Now what this will do is you can see this will have English, German, Polish, Spanish, Italian, French, Portuguese, Hindi and Arabic. So these are main voices that you can do. As you can see 11 labs multilingual V2 has even more voices. So you can select which one you want. But as you can see, they uh, recommend switching to 11 multilingual V1 model to get the best possible quality. So let's go here and let's just try with Giovanni. Let's generate here. Hola, mi nombre es Juan. As you can see, it's working pretty well. Now you can play around with the multilingual settings, uh, models. You can play around with uh, voice settings and obviously play around with the voice because if you're using a British voice for a Spanish, um, you know, uh, for a Spanish talking, it's not going to be really that good. So try to use something that's similar to the language that you want to use. So for example, if I want to use uh, you know, uh, Swedish, I can use English Swedish right here. And that will basically be a great start for my voiceover. So that's pretty much how you can change language in 11 labs and use different languages. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video.